morning. We're 30 miles south of Boston this morning, and we're looking at the site of Daniel Webster's old boathouse. My dad bought this property from the Peterson family, who were descendants of Daniel Webster's boatman. And they bought the property from Daniel Webster for one dollar. The pilings over there are what remains of the boathouse. The boathouse was to the left of the pilings. This appears to be a, uh, a man-made channel which had a huge boathouse on it. We have original pictures. And when I was a young person I found a powder horn inside the boathouse. Um, at that time my dad owned the uh, boathouse and uh, it was still standing. But there came a time when the uh, pilings were decaying and uh, the only thing left for him to do was to tear it down. I'm told that uh, one of the local people here fish house as opposed to Tom Pezzi's fish market which I was told by my grandmother was on Marginal Street. So it does make good sense that he would have a, a fish house here where the local fishermen could come up, own, unload their fish and then shuttle it down to uh, the Marginal Street uh, fish market. In trying to trace this land back before Daniel Webster's time, I've done a little research, and it looks like Daniel Webster bought most of his land from the Thomas family, the loyalists to the King of Great Britain, which included Ireland at the time. I believe it was King George. So. The Thomas family got a land grant from the king, and Daniel Webster bought most of his property directly from the Thomas family. That's my best guess as to who the original owners were before Daniel Webster. King George, then the Thomas family, then Daniel Webster. But that's a little bit of guesswork on my part. I'm just reading that from the history books as to what I think uh, probably happened here. But I do know for a fact that Daniel Webster did own this boathouse and uh, the Peterson family bought it from him for one dollar. And um, growing up this was uh, adjacent to my front yard. Um, we got a good high tide here uh, this morning. I don't know if the water really came up this far when uh, I was growing up, but uh, it looks like it does now. Um, so maybe I'm not sure the oceans are rising. But anyway, we got to go back across the street and uh, I'm going to be looking at some other